all right my wonderful people thank you for joining us now let's visit Imo state and see what is happening in Imo, the eastern heartland <laughs> information getting to us at this moment in Imo state <laughs> police launch manhunt for killers of four officers the Imo state police command has accused the outlaw groups in the name ipo indigenous people of biafra and esn of the gruesome attack on uh, our divisional police headquarters it was gathered that the attack led to the death of four police officers during a sporadic gunshot all right meanwhile the police command in the uh, retaliation has launched a manhunt for the suspected uh, killers of the officers Imo Owere following the gruesome attack by unknown government at the Awa Divisional Police Headquarters in Oguata local government area of Imo State which led to the killing of four police officers. Meanwhile, the police command has really said this and this happened at uh, Oguata local government area as four police officers were killed. Meanwhile, the local government area in the state led to the killing of the four police officers. The police command in the state has resorted to the launching a gun, uh, a manhunt for the killers. Premium Times also reported this, based on what we have gathered so far as well. This move was announced by the state police spokesperson Michael Abatam via a statement issued on Saturday, August. Legit, Legit Nigeria had earlier reported as well in this regard that some unknown government accused Bandamenium among residents of Aguata in Agua where they launched an attack on the divisional police station in the community on Friday night. It was also gathered that four police officers were killed in the process of this attack by the government who were said to have trooped in with a tripper struck and a Siena vehicle as they shot sporadically. Meanwhile, Moster police accused IPOP, that is the people of uh, indigenous people of Biafra, of a gruesome attack on the police station. As contained in a statement, the Imo State Police states that uh, they stated that the attack on the police station was launched by the outlaw group, the indigenous people of Biafra, IPO, and the ESN, Eastern Security Network. All right, this is coming from the desk of Mr. Abatam. Abatam also said that the command will leave no stone unturned onto the perpetrators of this uh, distortedly attack and arrests are made to face the full wrath of the law. Policeman kills two gunmen in Imo State. In another development, emerging reports have uh, confirmed the death of the two gunmen who were killed by the police on Thursday, August 4th at a community in a very western government area of Imo State. It was gathered also that the two gunmen invaded the residence of an inspector in the community who successfully gunned them down during the attack. Hmm. Right. People, many things that happened for Imo State too. Police killed, police no kill. Well, the spokesperson of the Imo State Police Command Michael Mbatam confirmed the incident via a statement. All right, uh, that has been on to this. This is what actually what we gathered so far from my uh, Imo State's police command. Mbatam have really made a very crucial, a very crucial statement and, uh, and uh, investigation. As it stands now, hmm, Imo State is in, will I say, Imo State is in coma. And the hope of Zadima being the governor of Imo State, I know he has so many followers and he meant well for the people of Imo State. Imo Light are really glamouring for governor and the Supreme Court has given us one and we are really enjoying his leadership and his rulership and we say that uh, mr governor well that has been that uh, you are really investigating to make sure that what happened in agua 
will not repeat itself again but all this thing that has been happening all through the day these do happen in the daytime in the broad light, light and the Nemo state police has launched manhunt for killers of four police officers recall that so many mayhem have been happening in Nemo state under the watch of mr governor who have been working so tirelessly to make sure he bring peace and equity and equality, I beg your pardon, in Imo State. But uh, before then, uh, a lot of people are saying, well, Mr. Governor, what is really happening? Since you emerge or you we are giving the mantle of leadership, so many things have been happening in Imo State. We cannot sleep with our two eyes closed. A lot of killings, a lot of, oh my God. Well, that has been a talk of the day. Without wasting much of your time, my good people, let me have your take and your reaction towards this as Governor of Imo State has launched manhunt for killers hmm. they said all oh, that kills must surely be killed but a lot of people have really been said a lot well that has been that uh, the governor is uh, taking good step in the right direction to make sure that the fish out those who are perpetrating this kind evil in eastern heartland we are there has been peace, equity, and uh, there is peace and security. But now a lot of things have really gone wrong. That is why Imo State, following the gruesome attack by unknown government, hmm, at, uh, especially using uh, Awa Divisional Police Headquarters in Agua local government area of Imo State, which led to the killing hmm, of four police officers. The office command in the state has resorted to launching a manhunt for the killers well that has been on today's my good people let me have your take what has he done that uh, that people are really talking about the truth has been that uh, hopes of the meant were for the people of uh, emo state but emo state is a place we are so many things that have never happened before it's not happening and people are questioning why why this is it from the hands of the governor the seat of the governor or from the people and now they are calling the ESN and so many people who seems to be involved they are allegedly accusing them but let the court have his case I remember my good people that is how you're calling it a day from here without wasting your time let me have your take on the comment section as emo police launches manhunt for killers of four officers the truth is that it's not only four that was killed a lot of things a lot of killings a lot of things that's not supposed to be had has been happening right in the eastern heartland emo state to be precise and let's pray for emo emo must be better once again all right thank you and remember to tap on the subscription button and wait for more updates thanks and god bless